Welcome to MyTravelGov, the latest advancement in customer service at the Department of State. Through this online portal, you will be able to access certain consular services. Let's take a moment to show you how to create your MyTravelGov account. This is the home page for MyTravelGov. Click on the blue box to go to the sign-in page. Once you have an account, you will enter your email address and password here to begin using the portal. But first, you need to create an account by clicking this sign-up link. You need to review and acknowledge the Privacy Act statement. Then, begin by entering your name. Your first and last name are required. Your middle name is optional. If you have only one name, enter it into the last name box and enter FNU into the first name box. After you've finished with your name, enter your email address. The email address you enter will be used when you sign in in the future. The MyTravelGov portal will also allow you to quickly communicate with the Department of State. You will receive account verification and account update emails from MyTravelGov, so this email address should be one that you check often in case we need to contact you. Be sure to confirm your email address in the box below. Now enter your mailing address. This is not required, but it can be helpful in case we need to mail any items to you. You can easily update your address later if you prefer to leave this blank now. Next, create a password. Your password must be between 12 and 24 characters long, contain at least one upper and one lowercase letter, at least one number, at least one symbol, and your password must not match or contain your first name, last name, or email address. It's best to create a password that you can remember, but if you forget, the system will let you reset your password by sending a one-time password to your email for verification. When finished, click the box next to I am not a robot. A pop-up box will appear with a set of images and instructions on which images to select. For example, this example says to select all images with stairs. The images are different every time, so you will likely see something different when you log in. Click Verify when you are done. If you make a mistake, it's okay. The computer will provide you with a new set of images. When completed correctly, a green check mark will appear in place of the empty box. Finally, click Create Account to complete this part of the registration. The next screen will display a notification screen that a verification email was sent to the email address you entered earlier. The link provided in the email will expire after 24 hours. The link will return you to the MyTravelGov sign-in page. Enter your email address used during registration and password. Then you will also need to check the box for I am not a robot before you click sign in. You will be directed to a verify account screen where you must enter the one-time password that was sent to your email. This one-time password will expire after 15 minutes. If you do not enter the password in time, you can click Resend One-Time Password, and another one-time password will be sent to you. If you don't see the email in your inbox, double-check your spam or junk folder. Since it is your first time signing in, you will need to set up answers to three security questions. Take a moment to choose the security questions you want to answer and complete them. When you are finished, click Submit, and the portal will take you directly to the MyTravelGov homepage where you can access the services. If you have any questions or experience difficulties setting up a MyTravelGov account, email us at mytravelgov at state.gov.